24 hours on a boat. <laughs> What do you think? Exactly. Yes. Good morning, beautiful people! Welcome back to You Live Everything in Wonder. I'm Luca, she's Sara, and this beautiful baby girl is Luce. If you're wondering, where are you guys? We are on a ferry direction Sicily! <laughs> but let's start from the beginning. We are fully loaded. Bye bye, Lucky Land. See you soon. And we are leaving direction Sicily. We left uh, Lucky Land, we left Piedmont, uh, we arrived in Genova and uh, we will be embarking on the ferry in a few hours. Papa. Ciao amore! Papa. Yes! She likes the, the scooters and the yeah. motorcycles. And the dogs. Guarda, 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 guarda amore! C'è la moto! La moto! Wow. From Lucky Land to Genova, uh, it was two hours and a half drive yeah. and we managed to arrive here in three hours because we were not so lucky with the traffic. Yeah. <laughs> it was pretty intense. Now we have to wait a little bit because we can have access to the port in Genova at 9 p.m. Yeah, the boat the check -in will be the 9 p.m. The ferry is leaving at 11 p.m. Yes. But uh, the check-in starts at 9. Yeah, so we will try to go there a little bit earlier and then have dinner in the van and then wait till they will let us embark, embark the, the ferry. This is the longest ferry of our lives. Yeah, it will be almost uh, 21 hours. 20 hours and 30 minutes ferry from Genova to Palermo. And we decided to take the ferry because we want to avoid the long drive because we have driven a lot uh, in Portugal. So we decided that we would like to try this way to reach Sicily. So this is that, the new way for us. That is also the fastest way because uh, basically in 21 hours you get there. Instead, if we had to drive, drive uh, till Sicily is uh, at least uh, four days uh, journey with us with the baby because with we have baby. to stop yeah. and to take a break if you drive from Piedmont to Sicily probably you can get it in one day or two days but this way will be uh, I hope <laughs> Luce, what are you doing? <laughs> uh, more relaxing we book a room <laughs> So we'll have a room with the sea view and with Lucia will be better to have a room, of course. <laughs> she, are you hungry? Lucia. You don't need to eat uh, the steering wheel. Hopefully daddy clean that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Come fa leone, amore? Come fa leone? We will show you everything from the moment we will enter the ferry, all our stay, what it will be to stay on the ferry for 20 hours and 30 minutes. With a baby, one year old, uh, yeah. little baby. So, and tomorrow at 7 pm we should arrive in Sicily in Palermo. So it's Genova, north. Palermo. In the north of uh, yes. Sicily. Andiamo? Let's go. Are you driving? Are you driving? <gasps> Dove la mamma? Ciao amore! Ok, we 
are about to arrive at the port, the harbor of Genova. Was it easy? Yeah. It was, it's really stressful, guys. Yeah, Genova is not the best for driving. Yeah, it's, really it's very confusing. Stressful. I think this is our boat, GNV Excelsior. And it's also raining. Which Maybe. makes everything more complicated. Maybe I need my passport or something. Check in this way. Mama! We are in line, guys. Having dinner in the van. Waiting. There is a huge, huge line. Mm -hmm. This one is the boat, uh, Excelsior. We have uh, our van uh, down there. Sara and Luce are in there. A lot of RVs. Uh, there is a beautiful inner four wheel drive over there. And now we are waiting. Will drive. Beautiful. Sara and Luce will be embarking now and then at the van uh, Second Chance will be embarking later. Now we will get the keys for our room. It should be a room with a sea view, with a window, so we can uh, see outside. But now it's Not dark. Now. Not now. <laughs> now it's uh, really late. Uh, it's dark, but tomorrow we'll be able to see this, the sea. Yes. The room, Lucia. The room. Are you ready? <laughs> Let's go inside. Let's check it out. Papa. Okay, welcome to our room. <laughs> we'll, I don't know if you can fit. <laughs> we'll the troller, stroller fit. Okay. It's time to get on the ferry. So tomorrow I can remember where I need to pick second chance and then here we have the room. in the room. Yes. We just woke up. How did you sleep? Eh, well, <laughs> considering eh. that we are on a ferry and uh, not bad. I wasn't sleeping in my big bed uh, together with uh, Luce and Sara. I was on this 
little bed uh, and Sarah was on that little yeah, bed. Yeah, we have three single beds, one, two and one over there. One up so. here. Duck. Which we didn't use. We yeah. have uh, a beautiful view of the sea. And this boat, you can say that it's a little bit vintage, the bathroom and on the floor it's not very very clean but we are not complaining but this is a fact so just in case you will take this ferry you will take this boat you know that be prepared be prepared because <laughs> it's not perfectly clean yeah so now we will leave our luxury room and yeah we'll <laughs> go luxury. around we will show you also that when you this is the room like you enter you have the wardrobe here on the right and then on the left when you enter there is a bathroom uh, the bathroom was not clean but they gave us one towel and then you have the shower the pressure of the water is okay like good pressure and you know what when you have a room and a place where to sleep it's 100 percent yeah. it's, it's precious when you are on the boat because luca and i we uh, we slept in the van in some ferries from baja california to mainland mexico and it was miserable I remember. that's terrible yeah. yes especially if it's a uh, overnight uh, ferry where you really want to sleep and even on the carretera of Spad, if you remember we was cold yeah especially because if you sleep in the van in the vehicles uh, where the vehicles are they are near the engines and mm. there was that smell of burning diesel and uh, that noise and it was cold it was terrible here is not allowed to sleep in your van like they say you need to take everything with you even when you have a, uh, a room because they for security reasons they will just close the gates and you cannot access the vehicles anymore the garage the garage yes they are closed so you need to have everything with you and now we are going to have breakfast <laughs> yeah Moody. how did you sleep well <laughs> we have the key of the room would you like the key of the room yeah yes. let's go amore let's, let's go, go. And we are having breakfast. I have a croissant for Sara with uh, jam, and for me a pain au chocolat, which is a croissant with uh, chocolate. Enjoy your meal. <laughs> Okay guys, now we have a tour of the boat. We are on deck number seven, where there are a lot of rooms with sea view or without sea view and everything that you can find on the boat is on deck number six so there are two restaurants one is a classic restaurant pizzeria and the other one is self service here there is the reception and here i think is the the city center of the boat. Here we have the restaurant and pizzeria yeah. if you okay. want to eat a pizza. <laughs> and then there is a children area and two cafes and a lot of services on deck number nine. Unfortunately, they are closed. There is no library, there is no cinema, there is nothing. And here is the theater. So basically, probably during summer when this is really full, probably over there, we do some entertainment uh, shows. Uh. Che vista, amore? There is a shop, one shop, with souvenirs and some snacks. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Swimming pool. Yeah. 
We are enjoying our meal. I have some uh, paella, french fries, uh, and I have turkey in salsa tonnata, which is a uh, mayonnaise uh, with tuna fish. And I have some sea grass grilled, some carrots for luce. We have also here the lunch box for luce ready. Ta -da. How's everything going, family? Family. Hey, Luce, what are you eating? <laughs> what time is it? Uh, it's too early. It's 2 p.m. maybe. We had lunch. To eat on board is pretty expensive, but when you book your ticket, you can buy some food pass and you have 30% off. So we basically bought 50 euros uh, food pass and we paid uh, 30, 35 euros. Yeah. And in total for the three of us, the vehicle and the food pass, the insurance and everything, we paid around 350 euros. And I think it's one fair. way. One way. One way. Of course. It's and, fair enough. And now we are looking around because we still have nine euros and sixty on left, our left. Yeah. So we we are searching for the right uh, dessert. Yes. Sweet, because you have to finish your amount, spend your amount. Otherwise, you lose trip. it. Uh, yes. Yeah, so we don't want to lose it, of course. And for lunch we did 36 euros. for dinner so they just live with you guys they said that due to technical reasons technical problems we will arrive in Palermo not at 7 p.m. but at 10 p.m. so our plans three hours later three hours later 180 minutes later. I think when you say 180 minutes seems less than three hours so 
it's a mess with the baby because we try to book the ferry with Lucia so we know okay we will arrive at the ferry yesterday at 9 pm she was asleep and we said okay we arrive at 7 pm we will search for a place a park for night and then we can sleep have dinner but this is not yeah also not because happening. at 10, 10 pm she will be already sleeping yeah and then you have to go down take the vehicle yeah outside look for a place that we don't have wi-fi here so we cannot search anything ah yes by the way yeah during uh, navigation there is no wi-fi there is not internet uh, your phone uh, has no signal here in the middle of the sea Good evening beautiful people, we are here in our room, Sara is breastfeeding Lucia. We were supposed to arrive at 7pm, uh, but uh, an engine... Oh, Lucia! <laughs> I'm vlogging. She wants to be part of the show. So since Lucia wants to be part of the show, let's be part of the show. So basically one engine broke. So we are running with uh, only one engine, so we have uh, 180 minutes uh, delay, yes. three hours uh, late, so we will arrive about um, 10 p.m. We'll give you an update later, we are still moving, I don't know if you can see, we, are, we haven't approached port yet, you can see the, the waves down there, we are still moving. Okay, need to pack everything on Lucha's uh, stroller and then we'll be ready to leave. Guys, finally we have arrived, but we are still on the boat. And there is a big line now, we need yeah. to wait. Uh... Lucha is still awake, of course, with all the dogs around and all the people around. She's overstimulated and she would like to say hi to everybody. And every dog, know every dog. Cattle, every dog. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, we will see you in the van. Palermo. Yes. In Sicily. We made it. We need to second chance. Bye bye. Ah. 10:30 p.m. Okay. Where is the stroller? Outside? Yeah. Can you open the door or not? Okay, now we have to load everything in the van and then we will be able to leave the vans and the camper van and the motor homes and the cars are already moving. Bye, 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 bye. Good morning beautiful people! Here is where we slept uh, last night uh, just in a parking lot uh, because we came down from the ferry and uh, was late uh, but there is there are these beautiful mountains here on the background uh, 
Nada on this side. This side, if it wasn't for these buildings, we could see the, the sea. Guarda il treno, amore. Look at the train. He loves trains. Okay, so now we will have breakfast uh, and we will enjoy our first day in Sicily, amore! Yay! First day in Sicily! Ciao, guys! See okay, see you in a bit. Let's run, Luce! We are in Sicily! Woohoo! Si, amore! Si, amore! Siamo in Sicilia! Woohoo! Breakfast? Would you like some breakfast? Okay. Welcome to Sicily. Fish market on the left. People screaming on the right. Traffic. The sea. The sea. People parking in the middle of the road, <laughs> just like this. <laughs> But it's beautiful guys, we are so happy. And the smell. Ah, we are on an island. Ciao, Sicilia Bedda! Sicilia Bedda! Look at the fish, the fishermen. They just caught the fish and they are selling it here on the road. Wow, we can't believe it. Uh, I I can assure you, Sara and I, we cried uh, of joy, of happiness. Uh, it's unbelievable. Yeah. Wow. And what a beautiful day. First day in Sicily. Beautiful. 25 degrees Celsius, temperature perfect. Uh, Lucia is sleeping. We are enjoying the panorama. Beautiful, beautiful. And here is where we will let you go, beautiful people, in Sicily. We are so excited. Uh, this is beautiful. In the next videos we will be showing you a lot of properties. Uh, the property hunt uh, starts now. We hope you enjoyed today's episode. If so, please share to us uh, smashing the thumbs up button. Hit the notification bell so you won't miss a video, a new video. And please consider subscribing to this YouTube channel if you haven't done already. We love you, we appreciate you. Thank you for coming along with us and stay with us. Because uh, next Sunday will be super exciting. <laughs> I, I keep saying this word, but uh, I mean, uh, it's the truth. Uh, yeah, I, I'm speechless. Uh, I'm so happy to be here and uh, about everything that uh, will be going uh, on in the next weeks. Yeah, and we are super grateful to be here. We feel very grateful to to be here in, in this moment. So Absolutely. it doesn't matter if we will not find the right property or no, we are here and we will do the best. But we are positive. Yes, we yes, are positive. always. We will. We will see you next Sunday. And remember, la vita è bella. Life is beautiful and love always wins. L'amore vince sempre. Ciao. <laughs> Ciao. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go.